Okay, this is for uh, uh, Monday. I'll keep this for shooting range. And then uh, maybe this for self-defense. Three left. Shooting range, shooting range, we're back to the shooting range. Hey. hey guys, you guys are back. We are here today for another video. Today, we do not have a cameraman. I mean, we do have a cameraman, but it's the same guy that shoots and then uh, he's gonna take a video too, which is this guy. What are we shooting today? Let me show you. Today we are shooting a um, box of ammo. I want to see what happens if I shoot a box of ammo. So this is the box of ammo that I have. Brand new, uh, incorporated ammo, fish with cartridges. It doesn't have a specific... As you can see, the ammo are very expensive nowadays and hard to find. Let's put it back to to its place, huh? Okay. This is what we have here. Sorry, it's gonna be a little bit hard to show you guys the ammo and the stuff and also do the video. So here's what we have. Hopefully it does focus. There's 50 of them in there. Um, I'll probably try to shoot it like this first. Let me close it up so I don't drop ammo. I'm gonna, shoot a try, uh, I'm gonna try to shoot it like this to see what happens and uh, Maybe I just turn it the other way and shoot it like that. Uh, my guess, I don't think anything is gonna happen to be honest, but I will give it a try. Uh, we are good about very safe distance, about 10 yards. I think it's safe. Hmm? What's the worst that can happen? We'll find out. So I'm gonna pause this, get to the table, show you the setup, and we'll get back to shooting. No, it's not end of the video yet. We're back. Let's get to the table. But oh, this is gonna be hard to film. I'm literally carrying the entire tripod. All right, here it is. This is what we have. I have three of those boxes lined up. I have a little bit of a space between each of them. So um, I guess we might pass through one or two. We'll find out. And then I have a GoPro right there. Let's go ahead and shoot. All right, so we are about 10 yards away, uh, very safe distance, I guess, and we are going to use a 22 first with the beautiful Walter P22, as you know, and uh, see if I can hit the target. By the way, um, off the camera, I tried this Walter P22 on a target for the first time and it shoots horrible. So I'm going to take a couple shots to see if I can hit that target. All right, let's figure it out. I guess I'm not gonna ask, are you ready? Because no one's here. Well, I'll ask if I'm ready. Am I ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, okay let's go. We're gonna have to aim a little bit high. That's a miss. <laughs> That's a jam. That is a miss. That's a hit. I saw those lovely nine mils falling on the ground. Can we go and find out what happened? The weapon is clear. Let's go see what happened. All right, boys. So here's the first one. Where is it? There it is. This is the first box off to the ground. And here's our second box. Okay, I think I hit it once, but I see three impact points on the second one. So we might have had some explosions here. All right, give me a second, let me figure out what happened. I'll be right back. 
All right, we're back. Out of 50 of them, as you can see, as if we can focus over here, there we go. There is two of them missing. I found one of them. There's the jacket. And there was a bullet right here too, there it is. Where is it? Let's go focus, find out. Da -da -da -dun. All right, this is the part of this jacket. And then we have the second one completely missing. Here's the box that what happened to it and this is actually the second box. This was the first box right here, including the ammos. And here is this second box. As you can see, all are unharmed except we have part of the bullet here. Let's see if I can zoom in. Zoom baby zoom. There it is. Let me see if I can take it out. Oh man, it's hard to film and do all this stuff. Okay, I'm gonna make all these samples fall, so I'm gonna pause and be right back. All right, I took the bullet out right there. This is the 22, and it was hugging the nine right on the jacket right here, but I don't see any damage to this nine. Focus, there you go. All right. All right, it's time to shoot it with the nine. Let's see what uh, what happens with the nine. I have two of those boxes. Uh, there's 50 rounds in each of them. Same situation, 10 yards away. It's a full metal jacket, 124 grain. And let's give it a shot. It's a Springfield 1911. A beaut. Am I ready? Yes, I'm ready. Final. I believe I missed. I'm gonna shoot it again. Saw the box moving. So let's go ahead and find out. The open is clear. Right on the side. So you know what? I'm not gonna open it up. I'm just gonna reset it up. Or just like that. And I'm gonna try shooting it again. I literally brought the entire tripod again. So once again, 124 grain full metal jacket using the 1911 Springfield Field Armory. Am I ready? Yes, I'm ready. Find a hole. Right up target. Weapon clear. Am I talking to myself? Am I going crazy? Bringing the entire tripod with me. Okay. Don't see a lot of explosions here. Uh, let's put the tripod right here. Let's zoom in on the table. Let's figure out what happened. Are you guys here with me? Oh, you are. Okay. What I can notice right away is there is one missing. And then a... Oh, look. That's awesome. There is a jacket. Exploded, obviously. This is the back side, so this would be the second box. This was the first box. And then went right through it. Let me open up this one. Come on. Okay, pretty much there is nothing to it. One of the bullets is completely missing. I think it was pushed to the second box. And we'll go ahead and take a look at the second box. Can you guys see? All right, this is interesting. Zoom in on the table. Mm -hmm. 
There we go. All right, this is the interesting part. This is the second box. Kind of one on the bottom. I uh, have a part of a jacket. There, is it focused? It's part of a jacket. I have one of the bullets that got in. All right, here we are. I just want to make sure that it's focused and you guys can see it. As you guys said, this was nicked and hit by one of the bullets. All right, let's get to the rest of them. So, so far we found a part of a jacket. Are we focused? Yep. And then this was the one that it was hit. And let's get to the rest. The rest of it pretty much it's completely undamaged. I did change the position a little bit, brought him to the left side. So we're gonna hit him sideways to see if it's gonna make any difference. I'm gonna try to hit him with 556. Five, Alright, we are back on a safe distance. I guess we are going to show a 556 five, green tip focus. Uh, let's see what happens. I'm using an AR-15 stand arms. We are hot. Am I ready? I guess I am. Safety off. Fire in the hole. I miss. I'm gonna try again. Right on target. As you can see, we had a little bit more destruction over here. I'm just guessing this is the first box zipped right through it. And there is the second box. Upside down. Okay, let me get them back to the order. To see. Oh, yes, look at this one right here. What happened to you? Oops. All right, so I brought this little box over here so I can show you guys a little bit more, bit more better without having them fall apart. I'm still finding some ammo from the ground. There it is. All right, so let's find, oh, Jesus Christ. Are you seeing this? This is awesome. Just look at it. This one had a direct hit, I'm guessing. I see another one that it's damaged. Let's take them apart. I see a jacket. You don't want to see my hands, I guess. I'm gonna see what happened. Oh, Jesus Christ, you're kidding me. Look, can you believe this? It's another one. Here's a jacket. Come on, get out. This one doesn't want to come out. Uh -uh. Let's do this. this is okay. Here's the box. Meaning there goes the box. Get oh, oh you're kidding me see the destruction of this ammo and this is from one shot of 556 five, there's one there's another one I don't know what happened to this one there you have it All right, so pretty much these are the bullets that been hit, damaged, scratched or whatever in two boxes. So 
total of not 100 rounds because there's there were two missing I guess so there were about 98 rounds in two box and then this is what one shot of 556 five, did to them it's pretty cool isn't it Just look at this one Jesus and we were about what oh this is zoomed in about eight yards seven yards something like that all right so there you have it what's next let me get to the picture man this is hard to film and shoot and do all this stuff so i have one more box i don't want to open it since it doesn't have a part to just close it back up it's I believe 25 rounds or five 20 rounds of 556. Five, so we're gonna go ahead and shoot this one as well to see what happens to 556. Five, Let's get to shootings. Alright, so pretty much I was gonna go ahead and shoot it with a nine, but I thought since the 556 five, did a lot of damage to the last box of ammo, I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, try 556 five, again. So again using an AR-15, 5.56, green tip, uh, a box of ammo. Am I ready? Yes, I am. Find a hole. Did you see that smoke? I did hit it. And I saw at least two rounds smoking. All right, weapon is clear. All right, here's the box, obviously in and out. This box feels a lot lighter. Let me do it right here. All right, so, so these are completely undamaged. There's nothing happened to them. And then I saw two smoking rounds off to the sides one was around here I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to find them especially between all this shelling that is left here all right here's one here is one so th this was one of them that was smoking are we focused on it yep let's find the second one all right, there we are. So out of 20 ammo, 20 rounds, I was able to find about 16 total. So there's four missing. Uh-uh. There's another one. I spent about 15 minutes and then I missed this one right in front of me. All right, let's bring it to focus. So now we have 17 of them. Uh, I have two of them and there's a hole in there. Focus. Alright, so I have two that there is a hole in it. Those two right there. And then the all the other ones are all pretty much good. Nothing happened to them. So I have 17 and missing three. Let me count them one more. We have three, six, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen of them, yes. So 17 found, 3 missing, two, two of them there's a hole in them, the other ones are pretty much unarmed. I guess that's about it. I'm gonna try to look to see if I can find one more, but I can say there was another one smoking right there. So I believe there is three of them that got hit. And that's the result. There's no explosions, nothing like that. Don't try this at home. You never know what's going to happen. But um, that was my science today. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked it. It's a little bit of a messy video again. But I hope you watched it. I'll see you next time.